We have some breaking news now in the retrial of a Toronto mother accused of first-degree murder and the death of her daughter. A verdict has just been reached, and she's been acquitted on all three charges. For more on this, we'll bring in CTV's Kamal Karamali. Kamal, what are we learning? Yeah, so this just coming down in the past few minutes from Renee, hearing from our reporters in the courtroom, and uh, they're saying that uh, you know uh, this retrial from 2016 uh, happening uh, again in 2021. Uh, now we know that Cindy Ali has been acquitted on all three counts. Uh, our reporters in the newsroom, or rather in the courtroom, saying that uh, the verdict was met with a round of cheers, cries, amen from family and friends. We knew about 12 to 15 uh, supporters, uh, churchgoers, uh, uh, you know, part of her congregation were there in support. So we know they're also going to speak uh, outside, but this is a, uh, uh, you know, what Cindy Ali and her supporters were hoping for. It was eight years ago she was initially convicted for first-degree murder and sentenced to life in prison uh, with no chance of parole in connection to her death, uh, to her daughter's death. Uh, in 2021, uh, Cindy Ali appealed that conviction and was granted a new trial that began back in October. So uh, on Ali's side of things, she's consistently argued that uh, her daughter, uh, Sonara, who lives with uh, or lived with a disability, uh, cerebral palsy, died in uh, in what uh, as in the aftermath of a break and enter. Uh, she claims that two men broke into her home and took her from room to room uh, looking for a, quote, package. And uh, once she returned to the living room, she found her daughter lifeless with one of the men holding a pillow above her. Meanwhile, the Crown had argued that there was never a break and enter, claiming that she smothered her own daughter in an act of mercy to relieve her from her suffering So, uh, since she lived with a disability. So we were expecting a verdict, uh, Renee, to come down today on this retrial that ba began back in October. And uh, now we're hearing a, a, a new verdict from a judge saying that she's been acquitted on all three counts. All right. Kamal, thank you so much for this.